So my name is Daniel Carcillo. I played um, professional hockey for over 12 years. And after my career, I suffered from numerous mental health complications brought on by uh, repetitive head trauma and traumatic brain injuries. Uh, things like anxiety, depression, and uh, one of the scariest things that actually finally pushed me into treatment after two years of suffering was uh, suicidal ideation and suicidal thoughts. I say this stuff because I, and by all means, by all accounts, if you look at my life, it's, I have a really good life. Um, as a, I'm, I'm a 33-year-old man with a roof over my head, a car in the garage, three beautiful, healthy children, a beautiful wife. But for some reason, I was having suicidal thoughts and suicidal ideation and anxiety and depression. And every day that went by, it just kept getting worse and worse and worse. And so I had to do something about it. I had to figure out where those mental health complications were coming from because I wasn't born with mental illness. I wasn't born with a neurological imbalance. And what I've realized is that that was a chemical imbalance um, brought on by repetitive head trauma. So a piece of advice um, from my own experience, when I would harbor all of that guilt and anxiety and depression and not tell my wife what was really going on with me, it made our arguments worse. So I would implore people to, even if it's just writing it on a piece of paper and then crumpling it up and burning it, get it out of you. The, the reason that I speak so vulnerably is because I need to. Because if I don't, I don't think I'll be here for very long. I can't harbor that guilt because it slowly kills me inside.